Hi Air Signs, welcome to my channel. Thank you Gemini, Libra, Aquarius for being here for your reading with me today. We're going to be looking at the next major change that's coming up for you, what you can expect, any new changes, new chapters, anything new and exciting that's coming up into your life, I'm going to be relaying over to you. So um, before I begin, please feel free to subscribe to the channel. That would be amazing. Um, and if you did want to become a channel member, that is going to be the access to member only content. So if you want to sign up, you can do so via the link below. Um, and to anyone after a private reading, I am currently accepting those. So um, please reach out. Okay, so two of wands. There's, there's a possible move on the cards here. I feel like um, a different city, a different state, a different country is calling you. Or well, some of you are meeting a, a foreign lover. Uh, okay, a long distance connection or you're hooking up with someone who is further away. Um, air signs. Uh, okay. Okay, there's a destined Cancer or Sagittarius that's coming up around you. Um, and this person is going to be a new chapter in your life. I feel like it's something you've been waiting on, Air Signs. Um, now, the moon can be the past. So for some of you, you've got a past, a past thing coming up here as well. Let's have a look. Okay, I definitely feel like this move is coming up. Some of you, you might be in two minds about whether you want to relocate. I see you taking the plunge and um, moving forward with that chapter. King of Wands is is craving movement, um, air sign. So I feel like you are wanting to move. You're wanting to mix things up a bit. Different culture, different cuisine, a different way of living. It's like you're contemplating a big sea change here. And that's going to be very exciting. Now, you might even be in between locations. So some of you like... You might be setting up a base elsewhere. You might be doing temporary work. Uh, but I see you sort of traveling between two different locations. So it might be because you're seeing someone. There could be a romantic chapter here. Um, the past can be someone from the past with the moon. So some of you are maybe talking to an ex again or will be very soon. It's possibly someone that happened like um, things ended very like devastatingly for you. For the both of you, it was kind of explosive and it happened very suddenly. It wasn't like a lead up. So I feel like if any of you have been ghosted or, you know, you haven't spoken to this person, you might be making some plans to travel and you might bump into them overseas. You might even take um, some travel trips together. Um, okay, I feel like some plans are being made. King of Swords and the Four of Swords, air signs, you are either someone's coming back and communicating here with you, or you're making some plans. Either f This is either for yourself or for someone that you're talking to. It could be romantic, um, possibly even family, but I feel like the plans that you'll make, uh, the plans that you'll make, you're going to set into action here. So you're going to make it happen. Let me move this. That's better. That was annoying me. Yeah, you're going to make it happen, air signs. This is really, really positive to see. I feel like it's a positive development. Um, but I do feel like communication is coming. Some of you with the Four of Swords, you've been waiting. Um, I feel some of you have been waiting for like a, a visa application or a job interview response, or you've been waiting for someone to contact you. I feel like something that you've been waiting for is coming back up into your life. And you're either going to start talking about this or talking to this person or you're going to start making huge plans for yourself, um, for the both of you, actually. We've got the Queen and the King of Wands, so there's a coupling up, um, but I feel like it's connected to travel or relocating. So Queen of Wands is a strong Leo energy. Um, so it's either you need to take initiative, take the first step to get to that coupling up, um, or it's telling me Leo could Leo could also be like a promotion that you're going to be dominating in your field. Uh, no one's going to be able to compete with you, Air Signs. So you're going to come with, come up with an idea, a concept, a service, a job, um, and you're going to rule. You're going to rule the school. You're going to be, this is going to be epic. You're going to be like the focus and the center of attention. Uh, so that's fantastic. Now, we do have two kings, 
and I feel like two kings and the queen is telling me there may be a third party situation coming up or like options in love. Um, it could be a couple of fire signs. We do have Leo and Sagittarius. It may be a cancer who's coming up and I feel like one could be through like a trip of some kind and you sort of connect through there. Or I don't know, maybe you're looking at other couples, air signs, and you're like, okay, I want to be in a relationship again. I'm ready. You've had some fun. You've done your thing. You've moved up from the past. And now you're wanting something more. I feel like I see you either observing couples or looking at couples or like you're doing something with couples, okay? No judgment. Whatever you're doing here. But um, something's happening, okay? Something's happening. Third party, threesomes, something like this maybe. Um, again, no judgment. You do you. But um, yeah, I feel like there's... um. There's a potential creative chapter uh, as well, and I feel like you're attracting a wider audience. Now, some of you are looking to expand your social media page, or you're looking to fancy up your website, or whatever it is. Probably be a really good time to do that because it's like people are going to be drawn to your work or what you have to show. Creatively, there's a lot that's coming to you, so you may be discovering a new talent. You may be going back to music. Maybe you used to play when you were younger. Uh, maybe you're going back to journaling. You might be revisiting something you used to do in the past. And now maybe like the universe is pulling you closer to this. And you're getting, you're getting little signs. And these little signs are sort of feeding into your experience. And then you're like, well, maybe I want to get back into this. A friend might say it in passing. Or you, a sibling or a parent might be like, remember when you did this? Or you might be looking over some photos and looking at some hobbies you used to have. It could very well be that you take up past creative pursuits or hobbies or something that you used to have and you reintroduce it into your life. So I feel like as much as it's a new chapter, it's kind of familiar or something you've been doing before. You've been exposed to it before. So I don't think it's entirely new, but in a good way, it's like you're ready to get back into it type thing. Could be a relationship, could be a hobby. Uh, something like that but I mean that's that's really positive I feel um so you've got some wonderful uh developments here so that's fantastic um I'm gonna leave it there as science so thank you everyone for watching it does mean a lot I hope to be in touch very very soon don't forget to drop a like if you've enjoyed this video please subscribe to the channel if you did want to become a channel member you will get access to member only tarot content you can do that via the join button on my home page otherwise I am gonna leave it there so thank you everyone so so much for watching all the best and bye for now